Hi, this is Mark Littleton, the minister of the Word for the Athens Church of Christ, with today's three-minute sermon. In Isaiah chapter 41 and verse 10, God makes this promise. He says, Fear not, for I am with you. Be not dismayed, for I am your God. I will strengthen you. I will help you. I will uphold you with my righteous right hand. There are so many things in this life, if we're honest, that make us afraid, aren't there? Right now, as we think about what's going on around us with uh, the pandemic and the virus, there, there are many aspects of that that make us very fearful. We, we may be afraid of catching this virus ourselves. Uh, we may be afraid of unknowingly spreading that virus uh, to someone else. We may be afraid someone we love is going to, to come down with the virus. There's so many things about this that make us afraid. And then we think about the economic impact of all of this, and we are afraid for our future. Schools are starting back in, in many places this week. We're, we're afraid. We're, our teachers are somewhat anxious. Our, our students are anxious. It's just so very easy right now for us to be afraid. And yet I want you to remember what God's promise to his people is. One of the most frequent uh, commands that God gives in Scripture is, do not be afraid. And he says that here in this passage. Fear not, do not be afraid. And then he gives the reason. For I am with you. It is the Lord's presence that is the cure for paralyzing fear in our lives. Well, what does the Lord's presence do for us? Look at the, the promises he makes. Because he's with you, God says, you, 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 I will strengthen you. I will help you. I will uphold you. And that's what we need, right? We need strength and we need help and we need someone to hold us up. God says, that's my promise to you. You don't have to be afraid if you belong to me and if you follow me because I will be with you. And I love what God says at the end of verse 10. When he says, I will uphold you, he goes on to say, with my righteous right hand. In other words, God is saying, I can be trusted. I am faithful. I will be with you. Does that mean we're never going to have difficulties? No. Does that mean we're not going to catch the virus or someone we love isn't going to catch the virus? No, it doesn't mean that. But it does mean whatever we have to face in this life, God will be with us. And we can have his strength and he can uphold us and he will be with us. My challenge to you today, friend, is to not be afraid and to not be dismayed. If you belong to God, trust in his presence and trust him to be with you. Lord willing, we'll see you again tomorrow for another three-minute sermon. God bless.